Today at Sangalo we're heading to El Salvador, diving into one of the most passionate stories in Salvadoran football, CD Municipal Imenio. This team, Los Cucheros, Santa Rosenos, has been through it all, relegations, comebacks and now they're back big time. This team has been bringing passion, heart and excitement to the game. Let's take a closer look at their rich history, their legendary players and their stars of today. But first, let's talk about where this story takes place. Santa Rosa de Lima, a small but vibrant city in eastern El Salvador. Established in 1743, this place has a rich history as a center of trade and commerce, sitting in the department of La Union. Every August, this city goes wild with its fiestas patronales. And trust me, that energy carries straight into their football. Founded in 1949, CD Municipal Limeño has a rich history filled with ups and downs. They've fought their way through the Salvadoran football system, earning promotions and building a reputation as one of the country's most passionate clubs. After years of battling in the lower leagues, Municipal Limeños finally made it to the Primera Division in the 1970s. And while they've never claimed a top division title, they have come close. Back in 1999 and 2000, the club made history by reaching the Apertura Finals, finishing runner-ups in both seasons. Even though they didn't take home the trophy, they've earned the hearts of their fans. And these are the heroes that made it happen. Brothers Rudy San Magdonio Corrales, the clinical strikers who always found the back of the net. Teri Manzor, the powerhouse left back who would later play in the MLS. And of course, their captain, Elmer Martinez, a leader on and off the field. Together with goalkeeper Santos Rivera, they were the backbone of that incredible squad. Fast forward to 2024 and Limeño once again captured the spotlight, reaching the Clausura final. This time their star player was Yair Delgadillo, the Mexican striker who smashed in 14 goals throughout the season. Unfortunately, they finished runner-up once more, but not without leaving a mark. Captain Walter Guevara led the team with heart and determination, proving that Limeño was a force to be reckoned with. This season, Limeño has built a squad ready to compete with the best. We're talking about players like Javier Ferman, a talented striker who started the season extremely positively leading the team in goals. Tereso Benitez, La Joya, The Jewel, an up-and-coming right-back who grew up at the club and plays for the El Salvador national team. Brian Landaverde, a midfield warrior. And signing Gerson Mayen, bringing international experience to the heart of the team. This squad has everything they need to make history. And let me tell you, the fans in Santa Rosa de Lima, they are the heartbeat of this team. Every game day, the city turns into a sea of yellow and blue. The passion here is next level. From their Apertura final runs in the late 90s to their recent comeback to the top flight, CD Municipal Imenio is a club built on resilience, passion and undying support. This is more than just football. It's about a community standing behind their team through every victory and setback. So what's next for CD Municipal Imenio? With the talent they've got and the city behind them, the sky's the limit. Could this be their year to finally lift the trophy? We'll be watching. Make sure to like, subscribe and drop your thoughts in the comments below. Let's go Limenio!